Everyone, this is Tim from Your Sick Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to connect a display wirelessly on your Windows 11 computer. So just on the home screen here, right click and go to display settings. Then under here, you can see I have four displays connected. The fourth one is my TV in my front room connected with Wi-Fi. So what I want to do is go to multiple displays right here and go to the drop down arrow. Then you can see there is an option to connect display wirelessly. Just go to connect and my available displays will appear on your here. Now, when you're connecting your display, you're using like an Amazon Fire Stick, Roku, or maybe a Google Chromecast, or maybe the TV settings. Make sure you put into the display mirroring option on the Amazon Fire Stick. All you have to do is hold down the home button and there will be an option called display mirroring. And once you do that, it will show up under the available displays. So mine just popped up on here. It's called Lord's Best TV. So I can select it right here. And then also here's my 55 inch ONN Roku TV that's on here as well. So if I select it, uh, it's going to appear on my computer now. And then it's given the option. Do I want to duplicate this uh, display, uh, extend it so I can drag an icon from the left to the right, etc. And it will be its own screen. Otherwise, second screen only. So choose one of these options. And then here it is once again showing up under here and you can rotate this anywhere you want in this order. If you don't want it to the far right, you can put it right in the middle or I believe you could put it on top too or bottom. Now, if this display is not showing up on your computer, make sure you're connected to the same wireless network as your computer. So if you got multiple routers in your house, you might have two of them. One's on the opposite router. So just make sure they are on the same network and it should be able to be detected. Now, if the display looks a little bit goofy, you can change the resolution and the refresh rate. Just select it on the top and scroll on down until we get to advanced display. And you can see the output here. Uh, here is the refresh rate. We can bump this up to 60, that'd be nice. And then if we go back to display, we have the resolution right here. So if you're connecting a TV, probably want to bump it up to 4k so it actually looks nice so it'd be 3840 times 2160 and then get to at least 60 hertz otherwise it's going to look very laggy so hopefully this video did indeed help you out if it did leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on your six studios